So this video is about fishing in the interior oh, of Alaska. I get a picture of all those fish. People don't realize how plentiful fish are up here. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want them to either. No, I much. suppose, huh? No. In the row, we just throw away. Yeah. The dogs don't like it. I remember that much. They do if it's dried. Oh, dried, yeah. Dried and a little smoke on it, and then they'll eat it. Yeah. Uh, I checked all of these for eating for it. And those all kipper, those collars. Yeah. But yeah, I used to be able to just power through, just push. Now I got Yeah. <laughs> and he's done. Yeah. You're not using the nail. You only use that when you need to score it, huh? Yeah, when I'm doing strip or something. Yeah. To hold the tape, hold them solid. Hi, hey, you got some eggs. Yeah. <laughs> Roll, which goes in the stuff that we don't use, although the Japanese would just love that, wouldn't they? Oh, yeah. They do, actually, but. Have you ever tried putting it up yourself, you know, like yeah. processing it? Oh, yeah. I make a little caviar every year, just because I like it. Yeah, I never, hard. well, yeah, I did it. I did it wrong, and they got hard. Oh. I don't know what I did. Left them in too long. Oh, okay, maybe. I didn't know. I didn't have anybody to show. So I've been talking with my friend Mike Carson in Nana, Alaska. We both fished for dogs for many, many years, and... He's been catching salmon, but my main fun is catching pike, and so I'll talk about that more. So all these pike are different pike. They look the same, and it's pretty much the same experience over and over again, but it's sure a lot of fun. I'm usually out fishing for a reason. I'm fishing for food, and I'm on a trip doing other things, and fishing is how I eat while I'm out camping. It's common for me to catch more fish than I can eat, so I turn a lot of them loose when I can. Some of the fish are pretty big, almost record size, and some of them are smaller and better eating size. Sometimes I have trouble getting the fish in the boat, so I use a gig to stab them when they're in the water or get them in the boat, kill them right away. I've caught a lot of fish over the years here in Alaska, probably hundreds of them. And this is what it looks like when I'm out on the river in the areas where I fish. It's usually very picturesque. I often see a lot of wildlife. So here is a lake I'm fishing at, and I see a bunch of swans. So get that filmed while I'm fishing. And here I come across a moose that lets me get close. His head is underwater. So the moose just stares at me. I go right on by within 20 feet. I leave him alone, keep on heading back to camp. On this particular trip, I've got a mammoth tusk in my boat. So I'm out looking for mammoth tusks while I'm also fishing. I sometimes catch grayling, but the pike are easy to catch, and I cook them on a grill while I'm camping, and it becomes part of a lifestyle. I have a website, which is my landing page, that is a link to everything about me, my knives, my art, my books, and this is where you will find links to videos and my blogs and everything about me.
This is the QR code. If you have a phone and you want to scan it, it'll go right to my site.